God dang, we should almost do round the clock coverage of the Vikings defensive coordinator search and how the Broncos are trying to F it up. So Sean Desai, highly regarded, spent a lot of years with the Crooked Chicago Bears, uh, was their DC in 2021, taken over from Chuck Magano, currently is the Seahawks assistant to the regional head coach on the defense, and he has been a hot name in defensive coordinator searches around the National Football League. But Earlier today, uh, well, first off, the Broncos requested to chat with Brian Flores, who's also a Vikings DC candidate finalist, uh, and then they uh, they requested to chat with Sean Desai, and then this afternoon, Mike Kliss, uh, which, by the way, uh, his nickname should be Kliss Commander uh, of uh, Denver Broncos area sports. Anyways, uh, not only have Broncos requested interview with uh, for Seattle associate head coach Sean Desai uh, for D.C., but Desai has withdrawn from consideration for Minnesota D.C. job per source. Desai interviewed with Vikings last week, wants to concentrate on Denver. Vic Fangio recommended Denver to Desai. And uh, you know, with the Broncos, Sean, uh, uh, with stupid Sean Payton heading to Denver, uh, he did want Vic Fangio as his defensive coordinator, which is super interesting. Interesting, considering that Fangio was literally the Broncos head coach a year ago, but didn't get him uh, as uh, Fangio eventually took the Dolphins uh, DC job. But Desai, you know, spending a number of years uh, crossover with uh, Fangio in Chicago, uh, could bring some of that flavor that you save uh, to that defense. And for the Vikings. Uh, I think, well, pretty clearly right now it's all in on Flores and Avera, where uh, if Desai does get the Broncos' D.C. job, which you're writing on the wall, if he's uh, withdrawing from the Vikings search, maybe he has an inkling that he has an inside track in Denver. Uh, Avero and Peyton talked yesterday about his future with the team. He's still under contract. The Broncos could block him uh, from interviewing elsewhere if they keep him. Brian Flores, like we mentioned, has been requested. Uh, but I think it's down to Flores and Avero for the Vikings with Petten. It's just like the fallback option where uh, TBD what happens with Flores and Avero with the Cardinals head coaching job and Avero also is in the Colts head coaching job mix but uh, I think it is down to these two guys because I mean, if Desai gets the Broncos' D.C. job, one, uh, both of them cannot get that gig. And if the, the Cardinals and the Colts go in a different direction, uh, the Vikings could potentially have their choice because I, I think that both of them will be fantastic on the defense side of the ball. Yes, they are probably going to be head coaches again. Well, again, in Flores' case, for the first time, in Navarro's case, very soon. But that's the cost that you pay. Uh, if you want a, a good, young, rising uh, coach on the defense side of the ball, a de facto defensive head coach to work with Kevin O'Connell, I mean, th that's what you get. But, yeah, D Desai is uh, you know, apparently off of the list. It sort of is what it is uh, as the search continues to go along. And how about someone just takes a Vikings job? Like, uh, Can we do that? We'll work on it. I suppose, as opposed to being everyone's second or third choice, but I get it. Fully understand it, man. But your thoughts are thoughts. Sean Desai has withdrawn his name from the Vikings DC search. Uh, Going to focus on the Broncos DC job. Uh, let us know your thoughts and our thoughts in the comment section below. Subscribe for daily Vikings takes. Want to support the work? Put a little something in the Venmo, but to next time, Skull Production Value.